Cheers everybody. This is Eric back with a video. One of the things I've noticed since I've gone to electric brewing I'm boiling right now, I got a little bit of time left on my bowl is the temperature around the kettle. There's my thermocouple right here, sitting right here. So I can stick that thermocouple on the get climbing. But right here. Cool down. You can put your hand that close. If you live in the south or where it's really hot, that is a big, big, big plus. I'm going to kick on my fan. That's a big benefit of electric brewing. It's the heat around it, the radiant heat that you would have. From your burner just kicking off all that excess heat and uh my fan did affect my flame so i wanted to just do this and see what you think with the pluses i haven't really found a lot of minuses um power bill hasn't really changed a whole lot uh, if i brew three times a month i might see a 10 maybe $15 bump but I really haven't noticed it but it's just now starting to get hot oh so I'm in June so anyway still haven't figured this out showing 209 degrees and I think that's the property of the boil showing 209 degrees by my probe in my kettle and I think that's the property of the boil when you're you're boiling you're you're having bubbles that are settling on your probe and when I knock that probe a few times with my stir that temperature come up to 212 degrees so I think that's that's what's going on there but 75% output is what keeps my boil rolling anyway y'all thanks for watching this is Eric uh, please subscribe and uh, any comments, suggestions, please leave them down below. And uh, as always, cheers and uh, keep on brewing.